So now what I want to do, I want to just dug to be able to go from here to go around and arrive behind that sheep and bring them to me. So this is a dog that knows a run. Awe. When he gets back there about 12 o'clock, if he don't stop by himself, then I'm going to stop him. Very good. He stopped by himself. Why? Because he know, okay, it's 12 o'clock, I stop right there, now I'm going to give time for the sheep to start moving the right direction and I'm going to bring them. So we want to always give a good head start for that sheep. Little boy. You see that sometimes this dog is going to lie down by himself. And why is that? That's because this dog understands what is pressure zone and comfort zone. So the sheep is moving, there's no reason for him to keep pushing pressure because then they're going to start to run. None of us on uh, a ranch environment wants an animal, uh, live, our livestock to run too much because they're going to lose weight, they're going to stress. So we want those dogs to relax a little bit and calm down. Now, on the cows, those dogs are going to work a little bit different because cows will require a little more pressure. And the way we train, those dogs will understand the pressure that they have to apply on cows and the pressure that they have to apply on sheep. So now I'm going to handle him a little bit so you guys can see how a dog that's trained properly will work and perform. Okay? And you see that I'm using the whistle, but we can also use verbal. Away, lie down. Away, lie, come, lie. Good boy. Stay there. And this is how full trained dog should look like. Can you hear? <laughs> 